So down back here, this is my laundry room and I actually have a little village that's up on top and there's a little painting that I made at a paint and sip one time. And I don't do a ton in the kitchen, but I do have these cool little inlet shelves that I always decorate for every season. And I love these peel and stick wall decor things from Walmart. I've got my Roomba plugged in. <laughs> And it is turning out to be a gorgeous evening outside. I absolutely love the view out my kitchen window. Um, I've always wanted one of these and Chris got one for me when we saw it this summer at Costco and Macy got me one for Christmas last year and it actually does light up. I just don't have it turned on. And there's my kitchen cupboards. I recently painted green and did the hardware in gold. Just has some fun lights and things, and that's oh, my favorite spot in the whole wide world, my coffee maker and my milk frother. And I've been doing videos today, so I still have my ring lights up. Whoopsie. And this is looking out into my living room. We have an open concept now, and here's part of our tree. I have the little Ralphie Christmas leg lamp. Just a few decorations up on the fridge, nothing too fancy. Ooh, make sure I don't knock over these. Uh, this is kind of cute. It's just uh, all of our stockings with our initials on it. And coming into the living room, my friend Jill has, she does needle felting and so she felted me two mushrooms and Jess got me one for Christmas on my present last year. That's a little wreath I made out of uh, an old sweater. So our living room has the string lights. There's no fireplace lit right now, but Gets nice and cozy. Actually, surprisingly, does not get hot back here. And so, so far, so good. I've been able to leave these things up. If they were dangerous at all, I would absolutely take them down. But the heat seems to radiate out forward. And everything is just completely cool to the touch on the mantle. So that's kind of fun. Mr. Rusty is having a little bit of a nap right now. And there's my mantle for the TV and a bunch of cozy blankets under here more of the Walmart wall sticker things. These things are only like three bucks, guys, and they stay up all year, and they're just a nice way that you don't have to put any nails in the wall or anything. That's our door to the outside, and we have some little shelves with some fun stuff in here. And then we're coming to the main event, which would be the Christmas tree. So this year, actually last year, Riley requested that we have a uh, quote retro slash Griswold slash Christmas story Christmas tree. So both the Griswold's Christmas tree and uh, the Christmas story one from Ralphie and the Red Rider BB gun, they both had popcorn and old fashioned uh, tinsel icicles. So I, and she wanted multicolored bulbs. So she said no Pinterest tree this year. She wanted to have an old fashioned Christmas tree. So that's exactly what we did. And I actually love it. Like it's just kind of fun and bright. And this angel is one that Chris and I picked out together 24 Christmases ago for our very first Christmas. She doesn't light up anymore, but we've still hung on to her every year. Her name's Alice. <laughs> and uh, this is now looking into the kitchen, but I really do love my mantle. It's got all kinds of different uh, like eucalyptus and berries and three, there's like fir and cedar and pine in there. And then this is my inlet shelves. The top shelf has our Advent candles. So this will have uh, all of the candles for Advent and then the Jesus candle that we light on Christmas Eve. And this is a Christmas Eve print that I was gifted by Jenny and Jerry Andrews that Jerry drew. And this is my manger that my friend Jill got me many moons ago. And I absolutely love it and put it up every year. And I kind of have like a white Christmas shelf. And then I have the little red truck and, and all the trees. So anyways, and of course, another manger scene down here. So that's the gist of it. I just thought you guys are gonna see a lot of Christmas decorations in my videos coming up. So I just thought I'd give you the tour and give you the little lowdown on some of the treats. So Merry Christmas.